up, boys and girls? I, I Fnatic here, bringing you another episode of High Pixel Sky Wars. And today, guys, I am so sorry. I owe you an apology because, as you guys saw from yesterday's video, me, Grazer, Will, and Polk all talked about the iPhone 7. And Grazer, being the Apple fanboy that he is, defended it. It was his last thing he was gonna do in his life. But me, Polk, and Will just kept coming at him with ideas and different topics about how much it sucked, guys. But today after school, guys, I caved in and actually bought the freaking iPhone. I actually spent only around $100. I actually pre-ordered it because today was the first day of pre-ordering. And it doesn't come until October 7th to 14th. So I have to wait a whole entire month after this day, this recording, is, which is actually being done today. I have to wait a whole other month for the iPhone to freaking come, guys. I've gone to the freaking, I've returned actually to the Apple side because you know what? My main philosophy on the whole thing is that everyone knows what an iPhone is, you know what I mean? Everyone has an iPhone, everyone knows what an iPhone looks like. Dude, let's just join the hype, let's just do it, whatever. We'll spend the extra money because we have had my iPhone 6 Plus for uh, actually two years now. So that's why I actually had the upgrade. So we actually have had it for two years and Grazer actually convinced me yesterday while we were talking off of camera just because you know, he was like, dude, just freaking pre-order it, YOLO. And I was like, dude, the AirPods are so expensive. He was like, dude, you know what? Just do it. I was like, fine, whatever. So I spent actually only like a hundred bucks because AT&T, which is the provider that I use in, in, in the United States, they actually have a program to where if I traded in my old iPhone 6 Plus, I get a $650 credit to where I can put towards the iPhone 7. And the iPhone 7, the model I got was the... I just got the black version in 128 gigabytes, which was around $800. So realistically, I'm only paying around $200 to $300 for the iPhone 7, which is not a bad deal at all. And the main reason I wanted to do this was because yesterday before I went to sleep, when the actual pre-order went live, I actually watched a bunch of random videos from like Jonathan Morrison who on TLD Today and a bunch of random videos on the first impressions and like first look at the iPhone 7. And honestly, I needed to be part of the hype, you guys. You can't be late in these types of things. And you know what? It's an iPhone. You're never gonna get sick of it. So I literally had a yellow moment. And I was just like, let's just go after school and get this phone. So I am gonna be part of sticking with team iPhone for another two years. But what, what is this guy? H hello? Um get comboed what does he do he's trying to rod me off what the heck get combo he can't even touch me what the heck are taking our first victory guys but anyways guys we have been going so hard lately in skywars